it has never been easy moment for us as a nation, as the world, because everything is beginning to change. The way we do things is beginning to change because of the pandemic that we have at the moment. And so I understand that things are probably rough for you right now. Things are probably not going on well for you right now. But hey, I, I, I want to beg you not to panic. I want to beg you not to um, give up. I want to beg you not to lose hope uh, of all that you do. I right? just want you to relax and understand that these are trying times that will come and go. Life has not ended. All right, and for those of you who are blessed one person or the other, I you to please stay strong. All right, do not give up on life. Um, I'm not here to tell you that it's not painful to lose someone. No, that's not what I'm here to tell you. But I'm here to tell you that I acknowledge that it hurts when we lose people that we love, no matter how who they are. I'm here to acknowledge that losing someone that you love is very painful. Losing someone that you care about is very hurtful. But I also want you to know that you'll get by. you get by because you have hope you get by because you are resilient you get back because you are you're dutiful you get back because you are not um, lazy you get back because you understand that life still exists all right so i want you to wake up every morning and encourage yourself and tell yourself that this is just life my life continues now it is not about being motivated yes you need a lot of motivation at this moment all right so my message to you to, uh, at this moment is to those who are bereaved of their loved ones um, to let you understand that i acknowledge that it is painful losing people that we love and i understand how demanding it might be at this point in time but I appeal to you to stay strong. I appeal to you to hold on tight and not give up. All right. I, I, I don't have the perfect words to say to you. And I cannot say that I understand how you feel at the moment. Yes, have I lost people before? I have. Not during moments of crisis like this. Perhaps individual crisis moments. But experiences are not the same. And so I cannot say I understand how you feel because we are not the same. Um, this this losses that didn't happen at the same moment that didn't happen uh, due to the same circumstances so I cannot I cannot compare all right and I cannot understand I can only empathize with you and I can only say that I, I can imagine what you're going through all right but I, I I join my heart with you to 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 feel the pain that you're feeling to feel the hurt that you feel inside all right and i i hope that you would overcome soon all right please do not give up on life do not give up on existing okay if you need someone to talk to please do uh, yesterday i shared with those on my mailing list that um they shouldn't they shouldn't give up all right they should just keep their themselves safe all right, and the same appeal that I'm giving to you as well, uh, that do not um, throw yourself up there because of what you have experienced. Do not give up because of what you have experienced. Do not conclude that life is not worth it because of what you have experienced. Uh, people might have told you that the Lord gives and the Lord takes. People might have told you that people come and go. There is an element of truth there right but uh, it, it's not it's not what you need to hear at the moment but of course the first thing is you need to accept that this has happened and the reason why you need to accept that this has happened is because you need to come to terms with it so that you can make adjustments to your life and move on all right and so you need to accept that yes this has happened that is not living the denial of the reality that the person is gone when you're able to do this, you're able to put yourself together and forge ahead with your life. Is it easy? No, it is not. It is not going to be easy. But will you be able to do it? Yes. 
I can assure you that you'll be able to do it. All right, you will be able to do it. Or perhaps you have not lost the person, or the person is ill at the moment. All right, and you're 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 still shaky, and you are you are doubtful that the person would come out, or you are afraid. Uh, I want to encourage you this day that do not be afraid. All right, uh, do not live in fear. Okay, um, whatever you can do to assist this person, do let the other authorities also do their work. Let the experts do their work. All right. Um, Whatever you can do to keep yourself at peace, to take away the anxiety and the fear, as long as it's LD, all right, go ahead and do that. Um, sing, dance, um, don't ponder too much, don't think too much about it, keep yourself safe, check up on them, don't result to drinking or smoking, because this can become very habitual at the end of the day. But anything that you can do that is um, legal, that is LD, to keep yourself uh, uh, to keep yourself sane at this point in time please go ahead and do it and if you ever want to talk to anyone uh, check out the mental health organizations in your country uh, if you're in Nigeria for example I know mentally aware Nigeria initiative um, I can also contact me if if Mental Health Energy Initiative offers free, free, free counseling. Uh, you could also check out the Live Vulnerable um, Joint Link specifically. Uh, I know in Australia they have uh, Beyond Blue. Um, they have Sane and other countries around, around, around the world. All right, do not go through this alone. Okay, um, see to it that you talk to someone. Always ask someone that you're talking to. Okay, you can join my mailing list. All right, uh, I'm going to drop it at the end of this video. You can check out my YouTube channel. I've, I've done lessons on how to uh, cope with with um, moments of grief and how long it should last and stuff like that uh, on my YouTube channel. I also have a book that I wrote uh, some years back, I think 2017 or so, uh, about coping with grief and loss. It's called Beyond Blue right you can read it it's an it's an amazon all right if you want to purchase directly from me i may send it to you if you make requests of course no hard copy and i'm not sure you'll be able to get amazon paperback at this point in time but yes you can always do make do with the with a soft copy of the ebook all right so please uh don't give up all right uh i join my heart with yours that your loved one will recover and i empathize with you that you recover as well if you have lost one person or, or persons all right but like i said stay strong for yourself stay strong for those who are still alive and be hopeful and maintain your ig and do all they have been told to do i care about you see you soon